So it's early morning, just looking at this tomato plant that's kind of grown out of control. So we're finding these droppings under the tomato plant. And it's a good sign that we've got a tomato worm. So we're gonna try and find it. Also finding some of these branches where all the leaves have been eaten, kind of just nibbled down just to the, to the branch itself. So there's a good sign here. Tomato worm has been nearby. If we carefully look at this, we might be able to find tomato worm somewhere in here. Oh, and I just spotted it actually, it's way up here. It's hard to catch, it's hard to see these guys because they really blend in, but you can see it right here. It's kind of cold this morning, it's not really active right now, but pull this guy off and uh, try and trim these back today so that uh, they start to produce more efficiently. Okay, so it's been a couple weeks since the last videos I shot. <laughs> And there's some new droppings. They're not as big as the last ones, so I think we've got a maybe medium-sized uh, tomato caterpillar hornworm in here. And uh, I'm having a hard time spotting it. It's probably not quite full size yet. So I think tonight we'll, we'll come out and we'll try another method to see if we can find it. This is it. This is a UV flashlight. It's under seven bucks. And if it works, I'll put a link in the description. It's now pretty dark out and I'm out in the garden. I've got the UV flashlight and I've got something right in the center of the shot there. And I would say it glows pretty good with this UV light on it. So there he is, he's just a little guy, kind of medium size at this point, but in no time he'd do some major damage to this tomato plant, so time for him to go. Hope this helps you, please like and subscribe, we'll see you in the next video, thanks.